We're running out of show right now. I think we should get into the petty portion. Yes, sir. Um, I happen to personally not have any petty for today. Is that um, right? I would. I would tell you some more strings, Petty, but you know what I'm saying? That's that, that's, not, yeah. that, that's, that, that's not for me to do. That, I, that, that, that wouldn't that wouldn't be me being a good friend. You understand what I'm saying? So um <clears throat> let's go to some celebrity petty. Facts. There's a lot of that. Yeah, buddy. There's a some 50 cent and Wait, 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 wait. Let's do this the right way, all right? We never just do that shit. No. You say who this shit is sponsored by, brought to you by, all that shit, big man. All right? How about I don't fucking want it? No, I'm just playing. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> I just fucking I'm about forgot. to curse you out just now. You were this close. <laughs> you better be lucky you was playing, all right? You better love you say you was playing. The way I just looked at you, I was like, <laughs> I'm about to let this nigga have it, yo. <laughs> oh snap. <laughs> yo, all right. Oh. So today's uh we're about to how do I do it again? You know, you know this shit today's ain't written, Betty today's portion Betty portion is sponsored, is sponsored by, by P or inspired by <laughs> Sean P. And then I say P and then you say it's brought to you by Sean P. And then Strang says P. <laughs> And then you say a little something for 20 more seconds and uh, scoop it to be bop the be boo. And then we get into it. <laughs> all right. But right, so let's right, assume right. we just did it. Yeah. Let's okay. get, get into it. All right. Move along. Here we go. <laughs> <clears throat> I could, uh, today's petty comes from the good rapper 50 Cent. Um, he, what's the, what's, what's homegirl name that he been? Tierra Marie. 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 The love and hip hop chick. No? Yes. Uh, well, she owes Fifth some money, right? Uh, That's a bad position to be in. That we we all have we have all been made aware that that's a a, a, a terribly whack position to be. Yeah. Right. Um. And what was it? It was because of some defamation of character type of situation. I, I mean, I can't. I he can't. Said speak. He put the uh, sex tape out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He really didn't. Fifty won the case. You know what I'm saying? This is how you know. You know what I'm saying? He only he only sued her for fifty grand because he knows she don't got fifty grand. Yeah, I'm surprised but, he didn't make. In it a real lawsuit, you suing people for millions and shit. Yeah. But hold on, hold on, Rec. What you say? What you say? I'm surprised he didn't do fifty thousand and fifty cents. You know, you were petty with it. Exactly, right? But um, <clears throat> what is this? What does this say? Like, it says, "Bitch, if you don't give me my money," is the headline on this this article. It says, Fifty Cent worth thirty million files documents to seize Tierra Marie's assets for twenty five hundred in back interest. Wow! And past so that, due balance. So that means it's, it's interest going on that fifty thousand every time. Yes, the past she, she the fifty thousand going she up. A little bit on it. Yeah, the wow. past the the, the ba- she was she was the, what she had was a balance of thirty four thousand four hundred and ninety two dollars. She been making so, payments. She, she been, been making payments. Wow. This nigga fifty. See, folks, and this is what I tell you, folks. <laughs> Everybody that's watching, this is what I tell you about love and hip hop, man. All right. It's not the answer to your problems, man, all right? These people don't make money either, all right? Yeah. <laughs> Chick got sued for 50 grand, man. So, um... Everybody yeah, on TV yeah, ain't rich, man. Really. So, mm. um... Um, yeah, that's petty. I can't, um... 50, I mean, listen. I don't think it's petty, some, man. All right, hold on, all right. Well, let, let's talk about it. Somebody owes you money. <clears throat> why, you, why do you not think it's petty? I mean, have you? Because she blames him for something he didn't do. Mm-hmm. Do you think that she should have been able to just apologize about it publicly and and like, wipe? Away like I say, it depends. Because if she was going hard, like I know it was fifty cent, and, and you know she's sort of famous or whatever. What if she was doing an interview on somebody. How do you know it's fifty cent? And she made up some story and made fifty sound stupid. And she, what if she did all that? Then it's like, yes, I gotta do this. 
this was she will never do this again to anybody else because of what I'm about to do to her. Well, so some crazy. people need to be taught a lesson. I don't like I don't know if that's what happened, but I'm mm -hmm. saying if something like that happened, then yeah. If it was a mistake, if 50's like, nah, I'm gonna kill you over a mistake, then yeah, you should have been able to apologize and that's it. Okay. But I don't know the details. So uh, mm -hmm. I'm the rockness monster. And I'm here to let you know that I'm on Cameo now. Are you familiar with Cameo? It's a website where you can reach out to some of your favorite celebrities and have them send you shout outs, personalized, birthday wishes, wedding congratulations. You can even have them quit your job for you. And now I'm there. You can use the Cameo app or you can go on Cameo.com or the Cameo website. Find me there and make your request. We also have special requests for business. You know, if you want your mixtape dropped on or your album promote, any promotional things, special pricing for that. See us there. Rockness Monster on Cameo. Rock on, rock on. But still, it still feels kind of petty when you know when you yeah, know yeah, that they can't afford it and that's what you're going to stick them with and and all right not only are not only are they not <clears throat> not only did, did you stick them with that number but you seizing assets and shit yeah that, but that, it, that, is, is she petty for not even knowing 50 cent but trying to put him in her story so her shit can seem bigger she knew because how else could he had to put the tape out he didn't. That's my point. Some people she, might say, oh, 50 Cent did it to make it seem bigger than it really is. Oh, I know, but that's what I'm saying. Even though he didn't do it. But why would she think she did it if she didn't know him at all? Like, exactly. like if somebody stole... Because maybe he hit it before or something. Okay, so what I'm saying, they knew each other. They they, they had to know each yes. other. Yes. <laughs> they had to know each other. I mean, it, I was it makes gonna say something, but I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying, it makes sense to reason that they did know each other because yeah. she didn't say Rockness Monster did it. You understand what I'm saying? Like, how many people you hit that you don't know, Rock? Right. Let's just, let's just leave it right there. Let's just, you don't got to answer that. I had to these process make my question. point. All right. I had to process the question first. Um, but 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 what? So what are you saying though? that he still could have not known her and it just could have been a thing. It could have been an hour. It could have been a day. It could have been a week. It could have been just something like, yo, I don't really know her. People sometimes use your name to make stuff bigger than what it is. You know what I'm saying? You think you she could have took a picture with somebody. Name. Listen, you could have took a, you took pictures with plenty of people. When mm -hmm. people come see those pictures in those people's houses or phones and stuff, they mm -hmm. say, Rock's my man. Yeah, we had dinner last night. We did this and that. I talked to him just yesterday. This stuff never happened. You know what I'm here's, saying? The, here's the thing though so i'm saying what if that Sarah happened marie was famous famous at one point when what who was she signed to jay-z or something yeah, Jay -Z. Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah yeah so when she was signed to jay-z she was a big deal you know what i'm saying i'm sure 50 cent knew exactly who she was you know what i'm saying like it's, it's almost like impossible that he didn't you know what i'm saying and yeah i'm pretty sure he knows who she was that's why he sued exactly. her exactly well of course but i'm saying like if he did hit it or whatever, that's neither here nor there. It's the suing and uh, taking somebody's assets that you know for a fact can't afford it. That's the petty, petty ish. But my point is maybe she knew 50 didn't do it and she tried to make the sex tape bigger, may sell more sex tapes because 50, 50 names is attached no to it. I don't think she's making no money off of it. I think Not she now, yeah, because she got sued. No, this I is think, why she I probably think got she, sued. This didn't is what I'm even want it to be leaked or something. It was leaked. I don't think it was like he sold it to like Vivint or whatever and or whatever that company is that be putting out sex tapes. <laughs> what <Well, laughs> should have did was own the sex tape and start selling it. For real? No, no that's not what he should have did. We about we 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 are uh, we have to wrap up. <laughs> <laughs> and that is sex tape, sell it. Okay. And that is the end of our Get show your today, money back, and all right? And you start Thank making you. future profits. Thank you for okay. joining us. She didn't have it anywhere in the world. Hold on, hold on. No. She didn't have no. the money to pay no. this no. nigga. No. She was making money on the tape. Tape. <laughs> on the tape. But you were here with us. We like to <laughs> thank you. Thanks for, on behalf Everybody of my co host. The strength. You hit strang one at 1 800 S T A R A N G. DJ right. Wreck. My our God. lovely producer, our sponsors. Uh, good DBT. Decisions, you motherfuckers. Uh, to, to Dash Radio. 
fucking Black League AO Delicious Records. Vinyl. Delicious vinyl. Solid Ice yeah. LLC. I said that you was you were still trying to studio. I said that you were still trying to get us canceled at that time though. Foreign but, um, language. What's up, man? <laughs> Cabetta. We will see you guys next week. We love you, Rock On. The gang go. Sell the tape 50. Uh, your tag, sir. Cue the credits. Thank you for listening to Monster Mondays podcast. Please join us every Monday from 8 to 10 p.m. West Coast time and 11 to 1 a.m. East Coast time. Every single Monday, Monster Monday on the Dash app. Also, check out these awesome shows from the rest of our podcasting family. Funny Farm, East New York Radio, All Elements Mix Show, The Star Power Collective, The Cosa Nostra Radio, 5150 Mix Show, Block News Live, Final Coffee Mix Show, and Hidden Gems. Check them all out under the delicious vinyl on Radio Station.